Hi friends, uh, this is Vikas here from Networkers Home and today I will give you an overview of the checkpoint training that we run here at Networkers Home uh, for the version R80.10. Okay, we run a couple of programs on the security which you can see on the right hand side of the screen here including Cisco ACFTD and other programs but we'll talk about it later. Today we will talk about the program that we run here at Networkers Home for checkpoint which is CCSA and CCSE. So in this video I'll explain you CCSA and in probably next video I'll explain you the syllabus and what do we cover, what kind of labs do we cover in CCSA program. So CCSA is basically as an administrator program and CCSE is an expert level program. Uh, CCSA is recently they have got the new version called R80.10 and Checkpoint has started taking your exam also on this particular version now. So let's see what are the content being covered in Checkpoint CCSA here. So these are the topics basically which will be covered Checkpoint. Uh, the first is Checkpoint uh, security solutions and licensing. What are the various platforms you have? What kind of licenses do we require for each blade etc. Then there is a new approach called the order layer or the layered approach basically you have for the policy. So we'll also discuss about, you know, what, what is that new things that have come as, you know, the ordered policy or the layered policy uh, mechanism. Then the next thing we have is security policy management, where if you have multiple gateway environment, the other thing about this particular exam at this time is that this version R80.10 is basically focused on distributed gateways. If you basically go back to the old version, you will not find most of the previous CCSA exams on distributed gateways. This time they have they are focusing on distributed gateway. Then uh, we have basically uh, we have to talk about the Gaia and other things and checkpoint technology, traffic visibility. Uh, what are the basic concept of VPN? I'll, I'll also show you the labs here, but this is just the course topics here. Uh, you have the captive portal. So for managing user access for captive portal. This time the new thing is the clustering is basically included. So we have to we need to have minimum two checkpoint firewalls of the same version and we have to do a lab also for clustering of the uh, checkpoint firewall. What are the lab exercises we are going to cover? So a lot of stuff basically uh, is not part of the official learning but I am adding it as part of our so wherever you see let me put it in a different color here. So this portion is what we have added at Networkers Home where we are going to teach you these additional things which is not basically if you go to Checkpoint uh, website you will find the other content as the CCSA official content. This is what they want to be covered but we believe that the person basically should be able to install it in both uh, standalone mode as well as the distributed mode. So we have added these as additional content so these are the lab exercises. So installation of checkpoint on VMware ESXi as well as workstation. So two labs. Now installations of the installing secure gateway and secure management server in standalone mode. Installing security gateway and management server in distributed mode. This is what is being heavily tested now. Working with the Gaia portal. We have also added CLI commands which was basically or not original plan of CCSA but in our program we are going to cover the CLI overview of the checkpoint. How do you do the basic maintenance or you know configuring interfaces, doing the show commands, add commands, you know delete commands and all those things and the expert mode as well. So if you get stuck somewhere you made a, you know put a wrong policy, how do you come to console and on the console what is that you do that so that you can come out of those situations where you are, you are completely locked. So how do you modify an existing security policy? Then we have NAT, we will be covering static NAT, dynamic NAT, hide NAT, static PAT, static NAT etc. And uh, covering uh, managing administrator access to the firewall itself or secure management gateway itself. We will also talk about SIC which is uh, secure internal communication. And then installing and managing a remote gateway, managing backups, uh, defining access layer policy layers, defining and sharing security policy layers, working with various licenses as well as contracts, working with checkpoint logs, 
maintaining the logs if you want to maintain basically you know how do you basically maintain it you want to install a separate server for maintaining the logs or you basically can manage it there itself then we have vpn where we are going to do one site to site vpn example and one remote access practical and uh, then we will be basically looking at captive portal which is where we will see the user access and uh, then we have the clustering practical this is the most important and the new change basically so the clustering of the various firewalls will be basically explained as well as we will be doing the lab portion of it so this is all hands-on program that we have we basically run this program for almost four weeks on weekends or basically uh, one month daily two hours right most of the classes are basically online these classes are 100% online and live instructor led training all right guys so uh, this is you know everything about the CCSA program and uh, most of the other details you can find it on our website which is networkershome.com and do let me know about the feedback of this video so that we can you know make more videos about the scope of various programs as well as the syllabus and everything else and i hope to see you in the next video then thanks bye bye